Welcome back. Joining us virtually right now, we have Miss Catherine, and she's joining us to tell us all about Zero Waste Week. Catherine, good afternoon. How are you doing today? Doing great. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. So Zero Waste Week, it's about to kick off soon. So go ahead and tell us a little bit about this week. Okay, Zero Waste Week is an effort to get the word out about moving beyond just recycling. When we think about reducing the waste we produce as individuals, as business owners, mm -hmm. we're asking you to think about um, composting, to think about reusing instead of buying disposable items. We're asking you to think about repairing instead of throwing items away. So we have a series of, of online virtual type activities and education information going on. And we also have a few in-person activities planned. Wow. And so if people want to participate in these activities, you say you have a couple virtual ones. Is there a link somewhere that people can go check out? You'll need to follow us on Facebook and that would be at No Waste Lafayette. Follow us on Facebook. Um, if you don't do Facebook, please contact me at Catherine at nowastela.org. You can email me and I'll, I'll help you figure out how to participate. But also you can join us on Sunday. We're going to be leading what we're going to be having a self-guided paddle on the Bayou Vermilion. We're going to first reconnect with nature, kind of nice. the reason we're doing this, to get out on the Bayou. We're going to go upstream, symbolically looking for upstream solutions to our waste problem. On Wednesday, we're going to meet back in Vermilionville at their restaurant, La Cuisine de Maman, to tour their rocket composter. We're going to learn about how that restaurant uses their food waste to create a soil amendment that they use in the gardens at Vermilionville. Oh, wow. We'll be learning about composting. And on Saturday, join us downtown at the main library. We're going to be having a fix-it event. You can bring broken items that you may be hanging on to because you love them, that they need to be repaired. And we will have volunteers there who will teach you about repairing items. When we're able to repair our items and not throw them away, that helps us conserve resources and helps us to keep those items in the economy. I, I love this idea. It's truly fabulous. Um, I believe we're kind of running out of time, but so really quick before we go, how can people learn more and why do you think it's so important that people participate in Zero Waste Week? I think it's important because we're at a time where uh, recycling is strained and we have to just go a little bit beyond and learn more about other ways to reduce our waste. It is a great way to reduce waste, but there's other ways, like I had said, composting, mm -hmm. reuse and repair. But to be involved, follow us on Facebook at No Waste Lafayette. Also, you can email me at Catherine, that's C-A-T-H-E-R-I-N-E, at nowastela.org. Well, Catherine, thank you so much for joining us virtually this afternoon to share about Zero Waste Week. Thank you. Absolutely. If you guys want to learn more, don't worry. All of this information is going to be on our website, klaf.com. Stay with us. We'll be right back after this.